fill out. All right, fellow stackers. And for this test, it is called a balance test. This is a test that you can get on Amazon. I paid about $25 for it. And these are only for specific silver coins. They do sell this for gold. Um, but the reason why I don't have it is because I really don't own a lot of gold coins. And plus, I will never buy any gold coins off a third market. And when I said a third market, that is a private seller. I will never meet somebody um, and buy any gold point, uh, any gold coins. That is for me, my personal is that's just too much money to invest in and, and, and have a counterfeit. So, but for silver coins, this is really great. It's really simple. You can carry this in your pocket. And this is for kangaroos, American Eagles, Maple Leaf, Philharmonics, the Hasahi, Buffalo Rounds, Cougarons, and Britannia. And what this does is it does several things. You can test the depth, as you can see here, the depth of each coin. It should fit nice and snug in there. It also tests the diameter, but I'm just gonna tell you one thing. I don't ever use this as a testing the diameter because really it doesn't tell you what coin should be for what, so it makes no sense. But I do use this for the balance and the way this thing works, and this is pretty cool. So there's two sides. So you have to use both sides when you test the balance. So really quick, and then I'm gonna show you how it works. So when you put it this way, it says coin should tip on this side so what that means is when you place it on a surface level and you place your coin here it should tip see right here see how this tipped up so when you put that coin it should tip up so that's part one of the test okay and then this is what it tests is if it's balanced and then you flip it over so this is the other side now and then it says the coin should not tip so when you put a coin here, if it tips, that tells you that it's a counterfeit. That is, that coin is not balanced. If it doesn't tip, then that tells you, and like I said, always, always do one or two different types of tests. Never go by just one. Uh, it is more likely a real silver coin. So I'm gonna test it out. So I'm gonna show you guys, and I'm gonna kind of zoom in a little bit here so you guys can see better. Okay, and then I'm gonna try that with several ones so you guys can know. So this is, we're gonna do a 26, 2016 American Eagle. So now when you put it in there, you gotta get it right in the middle, center. We gotta make sure it's nice and center. And automatically, you see that. It's just lifted up. So I'm gonna put that down. There it is. Okay, so that's part one. So that's what it should do, right? Because it says right here, coin should tip on this side. So now I'm going to flip it around. Now the coin should not tip. So I'm going to make sure you put in a flat level surface. We're going to do it again. You got to make sure that it's nice and center inside here. You don't want to. And there it is, guys. Notice it did not tip up. I'm going to show you guys. That's tip up, I'm gonna let go, and it went back down. So this American Eagle is balanced. So that tells me that it is, is an authentic. And, all right, so let's try this one more time. We're gonna try this one, uh, let's see what we got here. Let's try Canadian Maple, since it's a lot smaller, so you guys can see the difference. Okay, now we're gonna do the same side. Coin should not tip. So we're gonna put the Canadian Maple here. This is a lot smaller. You gotta make sure it's nice and center. There it is. It did not tip. I'm gonna show you guys. That's tip. And that went back down. Okay. Now remember what I said. You gotta do. This takes two parts. We're gonna flip it over. Now in this part it says the coin should tip. So we're gonna make sure it's nice and balanced. And there it is. It tipped up. I'm gonna push it down and it went back up. So that tells me that this is more likely an authentic coin because it is balanced. Now, unfortunately, I do not have any counterfeits of any of these, so I cannot test it 
a hundred percent whether that how accurate that is um if i'm able to access a counterfeit american eagle or any of the other coins i would i would throw in a i'll do another video to show you guys but like i said i've only had i don't have any counterfeits so i can't prove it a hundred percent if this is a hundred percent accurate but like i said it has worked for me um but i haven't found a coin that's been counterfeit so I'll leave that up to you guys. If you guys want to use something like this, like I said, I bought this on Amazon. I paid about $25. This is available in silver and for gold. Once again, it's the coin balance. All right.